Hey everybody, long time no see and welcome back to the channel. If you are new, welcome in. I'm LeBron Jade and today we're continuing our playthrough of Elisa. All right, it's been a while. I'm sorry. I had a lot of headaches going on. Thank y'all so much for the nice words in the community tab, but I'm feeling a lot better. I also just wanted to kind of turn my brain off. I think I was having headaches from work, 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 and then just trying to get all this output on on top of allergies and so anyway it was nice i played dead by daylight for like hours on end for a couple of days <laughs> it was really fun i got to play a lot of wesker it was awesome but i know you guys were excited for this too especially for this cute little puppet over here it's safe to come out you can come out but yes i know you guys have been uh waiting for this thank you so much for your patience so we just got a whole bunch of new items but as you can see, I'm a little broke joke. So what I think we should do, uh, and I don't have any, oh yeah, I forgot about this pulse meter. Uh, what I'm gonna do is try to get some coins or cogwheels, sorry. Cogwheels, tooth, tooth wheels, tooth wheels, sorry. Tooth wheels, it's been a while. Woo, gonna have to get my Elisa legs back. But thank you guys so much for joining, and let's go kill this guy in here. Um, let me make sure I'm reloaded. Oh my god, it's been a while. Uh, let's do some quick turns. Okay. Alright. Let's hopefully keep that performance when we're in here. So, the sword wouldn't work on this guy, so that's why I think I'm gonna try the blunderbuss. I think that's what this is called. Come here! Come here. Get close. Get close. I want to hit you where it hurts. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now we got to reload, though. That's kind of the, the hard part. Okay. Reload, please. Thank you. Thank you. Right in the face. This guy's got to give enough, right? Or a lot. Let's reload. Let's wait till he gets close. At least I think that hurts more. Uh... Ah! Uh, oh, no! Woo! If he hit me, I think I would have died. That's literally how- look at my health. We did it! Alright, let's go! Give me all of those, sir. How many did he give? I had 28, I think. Oh! Look at that! I think he gave 10. Uh, is that all, sir? I'm trying to move his body to make sure. I think that's it. Also, I wanted to check this out. She keeps talking about medicine here. Some, yeah, strong herbs. Some of them could be used as medicine. Yes, there we go. I just had to double click it. Okay. Anything else? The food on the table is made of wax or something. Looks quite real. Wax? Just an old oven. Ah, uh, this is where we got the letter. And just to fill you guys in on where we are right now. We need to go to the fun house area. I think that's what it's called. Um, where's that, where that ring is in the middle. Uh, and we need to input the code for the sheep. And we have a whole new underwater area to explore too, so. Sink is filled with porcelain doll parts. Looks like there are some cog shaped pieces here as well. Uh-huh. Couple tooth wheels. Oh, what did that give me? Okay, that gave me like four, I think. I think we were at 38 before. Sick! Um, we don't have a new key or anything like that. I'm gonna go ahead and use this med kit. Right, and there is a scary doll chasing us. It is so reminiscent of Nemi. Nemesis, isn't it? <laughs> All right, y'all. Oh, and there's a puzzle down here in the water area. There's that bowl. But first, I think we need to do something with the sheep room because I have this pulse meter and it said something about... What did the prompt say? Something about it makes different sounds. The ticks of that clock in the sheep room. Oh. What's... There's a note on the ground. My mother escaped. She's roaming the hallways in search for me. It's possible that she senses a similarity between us. So watch out. 
she will try to catch you. Ooh, what, so that was to me then. Hmm. So there's a similarity to her... Hold on. To her daughter. Huh. Okay. So that's her mama. That's chasing us. Oh god. Please, Lord, help me. Get me through this. Get me through this. Oh, thank god. Thank god. Woo! We did it. Alright, so let's go over to the sheeperoni room. Oh, not you guys again. Come on. Come on. I thought I killed these guys, didn't I? No. No. Stop it. Stop. Stop it. Okay. Oh my god. I was trying to body block. Like, with the bigger guy in the middle or in the front. I was hoping he was body blocking the guy behind. Apparently not. Alright, I'm not gonna make you guys watch all that again. I'm just gonna go down, kill the big dude downstairs, get those cogwheels, the extra in the sink, and meet you guys back at those little nuggets. I'm so glad I was still recording when that happened. <laughs> she was in the kitchen! That was really scary. Alright y'all, I made it back. The beat is bussin' and we are ready to kill these. Okay, I still think I can use this corner to my advantage. No! Okay, yeah, not working. So, that's lame. The one in the back can also spam hit me. All right, we just gotta keep that up. We can do this. We can do this. Run. Ouch. Keep your tongue to yourself. Oh. We hit two. Okay. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Yes. Excuse me, can I get your combos, please? Oh, I see him. I see him. Yeah, we need that little... They they unlock modifications, so I think we have like a stronger magnet or pull so that we can uh, grab those cogwheels a little bit easier. Tooth wheels, sorry. Alright, so we've got some good amount of monies. 55. Um, also... To add to the elements of all the puzzles that we gotta do, the puppet man, I forgot his name, oh my gosh, why would I forget his name? Sorry, the room is this way I think I need to go to, the sheep room. Uh, but he has, or Dr. Edmonston's puppet, has rewards we can purchase. And I saw one of them look like a key of some kind, so that would be kind of interesting. Uh... Is it this one? Uh... No, this this goes to the safe... The safe room. But I don't want to go there yet. Oh, that's the star room. Such a trippy place. Loved it. Boom! Here we go. Ah! Uh. No Lady Dimitrescu in here. This way, this way, yeah. Oh, it's been a while. All right, I think this is it. So hopefully this will help us solve, but I think it will. This pulse meter, she doesn't say anything about it, but I'm gonna guess. Hmm, I wonder what output I will get from this clock. What the? Okay, so we're just listening to the, it's giving us different outputs of the numbers. Let me write this down. Okay, 
This has to do something with the safe. So, what do we got? Where does it begin? I'm seeing numbers five. Four, five, five, two. Right? It's kind of hard to tell if it's... That looked like two fives, actually. Five, five, two. Four, five, five, two. Or unless it starts at a different spot. Five, five, two, four, maybe. If hopefully I'm seeing what I'm seeing is correct. Uh, all right, I wrote down a bunch of combinations of what I think it might be, but what does this have to do with the little sheepies on the wall? I wonder. I don't honestly, maybe it's trying to trick us. Maybe the sheep, the numbers on, on the wall has nothing to do with the code we just received. And maybe the code we just received, whatever combination it might be. What if that's the code? All right, let's head over there real quick. Let's see. Oh yeah, uh, someone commented that when I was out there and shooting, um, crap, what one was it? This one? No, 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 this one. When I was shooting in the crowd down there, when I was killing the the symbol monkey, uh, that I had shot someone in the crowd, and that's where I got the tooth wheel from. Kind of sad, but cool, I guess. All right, um, here goes. Let's see what we can do. Oh no! And what's odd is I can't really discern the beginning or the end of the code. It to me. My first initial reaction was four, um, five, four, five, five, two. Oh my god! <laughs> so the little sheepy count of the small sheep and the count of the big sheep literally had nothing to do with it! It was just to show us that, hey, this room has something in here that matches with this code. Oh my god. What the heck? Oh, we put these back on the clock! Oh, yes, wait. Is there anything else in there? Fine. All right, sick, nasty! So excited, we about to get crunk on the clock. How are you guys doing, by the way? You guys hanging in? Doing great? Staying safe? Drinking water? All that good stuff? I hope so. Alright. This time. For real. Okay, Doki. Hello. Hello. Come here. Now we have to figure out what to do with the, uh, unless we just solve it automatically, whatever it is we need to do. Let's see what happens when I install these. Ooh. <gasps> now maybe the sheep on the wall means something. What was it? Eight small? Yeah. Yeah, eight small. 10 big. Oh my god, this is gonna take forever. Is there a way to do this real quick? Oh god. Oh god, and it restarts. No! <sighs> Sounds like this clock's about to drop a sick beat. Alright, I think it's 810. Guys, are you getting Silent Hill 2 vibes or what? Uh. 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 Okay, okay. One, two, three, 
four, oh, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight. <gasps> oh my god. That scared the crap out of me. Ooh, look at you. You're so cool. We got the eye key. I reckon we got the eye key now. So <laughs> now we can really mess stuff up. Let's freaking go. Next thing I want to work on is the little bowl with the little message in it or something. Something's inside. It's outside of the water room. Uh, yeah, so we've explored everything here. We don't need anything else from this section of the mansion, which is so cool, by the way. How scary would this be? Not scary. I mean, it's cool, but I mean scary as in... I don't know. There's something about big high up ceilings that freak me out. I don't know what it is. Is that some kind of fear? Uh, there's like such thing of fear of course like the ocean for example. Uh, I guess I fear big huge ceilings that don't have anything on them though. That's that's the, the kicker. If it's like this beautiful ornate chapel or I don't know, monastery or something that's that's great. But if it's something like I've seen in these nightmarish games, then nope, no thanks. It looks like a door, but it won't move. All right, well, we'll figure out whatever that. It looks like a sun, doesn't it? All right. Hello, other side of the mansion. Hello? Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, 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 hey! That's only for me, sir. Uh. Oh god, I have to reload. No! No! You son of a- I can do that too. Watch. Ready? And he really messed me. <gasps> There's another one. <gasps> I didn't think he could get me- I thought I was covered by the door. No, I have to do this all over again? Why do I get so greedy? I sit there and I go, nah, I'm gonna keep fighting this guy when I clearly have low health and I haven't found a med kit. Why do I do that? I'm so greedy. Ah. Oh. Yes. <laughs> she said it's way too hot in here and this is the reason. Hello, sir. Welcome. Thank you. Uh... Let's save. Well, wait, wait, wait. Let's let's see what we got first. Okay, a Wilson M1, a modern machine rifle, mostly used by military units. Oh, that's me. Thirty plus Luis bullets, full auto. Hmm. Hmm. I see she has this on the cover too. The cost is thirty-two. I feel like that's pretty steep for what we have right now. Maybe we just need something like this to protect ourselves. Also, this Hydra suit looks so cool for those of you that may not have caught the last episode, but I read this out. Wetsuit made of sleek synthetic fish scales. Plus 10 for defense, move fast in deep water. Faster release from a grab. Indicative of something's gonna go on down there. It's super cute. I kinda wanna get this. It's only 20. Thank you. No, thank you. Um, and then let's we'll switch over. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> um, yes. I might want to get this. I wonder what it fits onto, though. How Maybe I'll wait. Should we get any modifications? Hmm. Skin La Care protects the skin from damage. Implanted tooth wheels and steel wiring. Some things become a lot lighter. What is this? Gear implants. To what? Cost 50. Sheesh! And I would get this if it didn't cost 20, but we'll wait on this. 20 is whew, kind of expensive for that. Okay, yeah, this pulls us away from danger. Activate with the special button, whatever that is. This is kind of cool. This adds auto-aim. Grabs tooth wheels from further away. I don't think we absolutely need anything 
right now from this guy. Welcome! So we could still buy this. Hmm. Let's wait and see. I kind of want to buy a med kit though. At least one. Thank you! Thank you! I'm trying to be very careful here, as you can tell. Alright! This is where I thought the teeth thing fit. But. I don't think so. It says. Oh, that's right. It tells me a coin. Hmm. Hmm. Coin, huh? All right, let's continue with our puzzles. Oh! Oh! Charlotte! Charlotte! I need you. I gotta get changed into my beautiful outfit. Hello, Charlotte. Um... Let's put that... Sorry. Let's put that back. Let's go ahead and do that. Oh my god, I love it. I'm a little nurse. Sick. Okay. Feeling good? Feeling good. Are y'all feeling good? How are y'all doing? If you guys are liking the video, don't forget to like and subscribe. It really, really does help the channel a lot. But I know you guys. I know you guys. Always smashing that like button. Love y'all for that. Mwah! You guys are great. I missed you guys though. Seriously, I was like, man, I really need to upload something. It's been like three weeks. But uh, I'm telling you, I was having a lot of fun playing Wesker. All right. Um, where are we headed? This way. No. Sorry. This way. Nuggets don't come through. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Thank God. Ah. All right, y'all. I'll meet you. Oh. What? Oh, she's over there. She's gonna come through here? Oh, I doubt it. I want to see you try. I want to see you try. That's right. That's right. You can't. You. You can't, right? She can't. There's no way. What? 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 No! <laughs> oh my god! It looked like she was thinking about it. Okay, we're good. Please don't get hit. Please don't get hit. Alright. Gucci! We about to get crunk with the eye key, baby. Oh god, and these guys are gonna be here. Let's get out our sword. Yeah, shush. Don't, don't you freaking, I swear. You will die, sir. Dude, he's still reloading despite... Wow. Scary? And there's another one in here. I hear him walking. No! 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 Stop! No! No! I will- Oh my gosh. This game has a lot of anxiety- or they're not anxiety- a lot of pressure to defeat the enemies fast. They're so dangerous. Um... Let's check the maparoni. Where would we open up I key rooms? Oh yeah, in the safe room upstairs, there's a door that's locked. In the stairwell. And on the first floor. Oh man, there's, there's a lot. <laughs> Excuse me, goodness. Um, I'm gonna go upstairs, but First, let me check these again. This requires something specific. Yeah. Root-shaped decoration is blocking the door. Why would someone make such a thing? It doesn't look man-made, though. 
And then this symbol of a tree. Okay. So we have the eye. I think we go up here. Freaking love her outfit. So freaking cute. Hey! Oh god, oh god. Let's get in here. Let's get in here. Woo! I didn't want to get shot. Oh. Something looks like it's gonna happen in here. Oh. Hello. This is beautiful. Gorgeous. I see I have to go interact with that over there. But I wanna take a look around. There's a big open book on a stand. The open page reads, Thanks to Dr. Pierre Edmondson's invention of the tooth wheel, we were able to build a construction that moved personnel to different levels of this building. There are two cabins moving through a single elevator shaft. Oh, the elevator. Okay. Oh, I see something on the counter, or couch over there. Old science books are stored here. Something is here. Ooh, Martin shots. Let's go. Oh, this looks so cool. I love that portrait up there. Oh, geography books. I'm sure these maps aren't up to date. Lots of dusty books, many of which I don't even know the language of. This book rack is filled with autonomy books. Oh, I think it was <laughs> anatomy. Sorry, is that what it said? Oh no, an anatomy, anatomy, anatomy. Whole collection of religious books. Rack of books, full a rack full of books about herbalism. There's everything in here. Dedicated to classic novels. I didn't expect that, actually. <laughs> That's cute. Okay, all I did was just go around and inspect the books. I want to inspect this whole room first before I mess with this, what appears to be a puzzle. Portrait of a sad-looking nun. An illustration of soldiers on horseback. It's locked from the other side. Okay. I love those portraits up there. One more flight. Alright, let's check this out. Something unusual about this bookshelf. The books are stuck and the book in the middle is missing. Ah. Makes me think about that red book we found in our in our RE one playthrough right now. I need that book. Um, I have zero nothing, nada. All right, we'll we'll keep this room in mind. Oh boy, this guy's gonna try to. You oh. son of a! Oh. oh, I hate you for oh. that! I hate you for that! Oh. I hate you for that! That's right. Eat my blade. Mean, mean man. Let's check the map. We need to go to this room. Beside a Charlotte. I think there's a locked door we might be able to access now. Oh no, it's just locked from the other side. Hmm. What do you think, sir? <laughs> uh, let's save. I guess. Let's let's make it even. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Just cause you're cute, and I wanted to see you. All right then. Let's go to the stairwell then. How about that? I'll meet you guys there. Okay, this is the one I was thinking it was. Uh, there should be a room right there. I think we might be able to access with the I key. But I also haven't forgotten about our friends. One sec, one sec. 
up here guarding this door. Um, I think they require something given to them, maybe? Hmm. No, it just says it's barricaded. Oh, round shaped hole in the base of the statue. Okay. Something round for the statues. Something like a coin for the gate in the save the red save room. The one that's too hot. The hot save room. Perfect. I key, give me. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wow, three more doors. Oh my gosh. Let's go here first, I guess. <sighs> am I loaded up? I am. Let's go ahead and take a med kit. Because I need to. And we have this sick new dress on. There we go. Oh, I didn't need to do that. Actually, I'm just gonna use my sword. We should be able to, to knock this guy pretty easily. Down. <laughs> Shoot. Uh, Elisa. Down. Dude, come on. Smack him. Run. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. You're hard in the open, sir. He really is difficult. Maybe... Maybe we can leave him. Oh, thank god. Oh, thank goodness. I can't talk. Woo! That would be for the, uh, machine gun if we had gotten it. What a beautiful harp. I love the music in here, by the way. Some kind of drum. This must be kind of a loot, if I'm not mistaken. It's a clarinet. What's this over here? A big drum. Ooh, these are all unlocked. Portraits. Just another painting of an old man. Portrait of a proud middle-aged man. Okay. Whoa. Oh my gosh. It's very dark outside. I can't see anything. Whoa. So cool. I'm feeling, uh, like it's tunneling in. I'm, like... Getting, feeling claustrophobic in this room. The lock cover is shaped as a right hand. Oh my gosh, so there's tree keys left. Hand key now. Door won't budge. The man in this picture has a scary smile on his face. Another painting of an old man. What's up with all the old men, huh? Alright, we skipped over this door. Lock from the other side. Hmm. All right. One won't budge. One's locked from the other side. Oh, sheesh! Are you joking? Oh my god, y'all are so cute though. But, like, I kind of don't want to mess with you with the sword. And just the pistol. Um, that's where we came from. Ow! Oh! It looped us back around here. Perfect. I wanted to come back. Come check out this door. Woo! Wait. Hey! We're back here. Oh, so this just leads to your lovely studio. Is there anything important here in this room? Old grand piano. Oh! Check it out. That looks like ties. No fish! gotta go down to that area. Okay, let's try to loop these, these two so that I can go get whatever I saw back there. Come over here, y'all. Okay, run. Run. Run fast. Run fast, girl. Get it. Run. Woo! 
All right. Um, doesn't seem like we can do too much here yet. So let's let's exit and go to the door that's right beside of this stairwell door. Check out what's going on in the water level. Maybe there's something we can do with the eye key. Maybe. All right, right here. I love this map and the layout of this mansion. It's so cool. What's well, actually a dollhouse? Excuse moi. A dollhouse. Yeah, this little thing right here. What are you? A glass pot. Piece of paper. And we already read this, y'all. <sighs> it's just crying for us to to take them to the wide oceans. So... Uh, there's not anything you can do with it, though. Okay. Uh, let's go in here. It's a couple doors. Ooh. Love the sounds. Right hand. Ah, so we've come across two now. Two right hand doors. Shaped like a fish. Fish, tree, right hand. Those are the keys we have left to collect. That I know of so far. Oh, what was that? Did y'all hear that? Alright. I was thinking maybe this door? Aw oh, man, fish key. And this is blocked off too. So what do? Hmm. Well, there might be a door we're missing. Um, not here in the underground. Hmm. Hang on. Uh it's a reach, but we might have missed a door that will help us loop around better. I saw there was a door that was connecting to the save room on the second level. I saw there was a locked door connecting from the library. So I kind of want to go back there and check. Oh, was it upstairs? We gotta avoid the lady. I heard the music playing. Okay. Yeah, I think it was upstairs. My bad. Oh, she's still here. Is she gonna come upstairs? <gasps> oh god, I think she is gonna try. Maybe not. Alright, let me check this. Alright. Oh, she's down there. That's so creepy. Through here, yeah. Okay, I was getting real confused real quick. And this needs a book. Um. Oh, the locked door I'm thinking of is up there. No, this one, this one. <gasps> it's the... Hey, come over here. Open this door. <laughs> You're under arrest. You're one of the Emperor's crows, aren't you? Tell you what, we're all equal here and far away from home. You should forget about those orders. Uh oh. Looks like you've got company there. Hmm. Intriguing. <laughs> Damn it. All right, run, run, run. <laughs> Shoot. Okay. Best to use the sword. Honestly, we might grab this and go. T handle. Where the heck would this go?
maybe um the statues maybe yeah let's go check let's let's go see if that's what it is oh my gosh dude <sighs> so frustrating all right um can't believe i missed that cutscene it was hidden in the corner oh my gosh oh i didn't even check that door that's the whole reason i came back up there ah at least my detective work um investigation work mattered there yeah here oh it still won't budge darn it oh this one my god i missed two this is the door I wanted. Oh my gosh. Wow, okay. Welcome. Guys, I'm gonna blame it on this bright light Thank in my face. You. I swear. It is kind of annoyingly bright, but necessary. <sighs> okay. Now, let's go back downstairs. I think this is gonna be like a, a wrench of, of some sort. It's gonna maybe open those tridents or spears. That's at least I think it's like it operates like a crank. Yeah, that's the right word. Um, I think it's no, 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 no. This is the water one. My bad. This one. Okay, I made it back. In the place I need to be, I think. The place of which I think I need to be. To be clear. Dude, this is totally giving me RE1 vibes. 96 RE vibes. Okay, this is this is what I think. I think we put this. God, I could be totally wrong. Ah oh, man. Yeah, the, those... It looks too large. Alright, let me put my thinking cap on. What would we do with this thing? There's so many doors I'm not remembering. Let's check the map. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, okay. I just realized, though, I've been recording for a while. I'm trying to keep these episodes a little shorter for you guys and for my sanity as well, because I have to edit them. <laughs> uh, thank you guys so much for joining me back again on this episode of Elisa. I'm loving it. I hope you guys are too, and hope to see you guys on the next one. Ciao!